Hello and welcome to our quick tour and opinion of the Sky Suite, the largest and most expensive suite on board Sky Princess. There are only two on board and we spent a few hours in one of them. So, what did we think? I'm going to begin a little negative, but having a good poke around, there's nothing that really dazzles you. No baby grand piano that looks cool but you'll never play. No priceless Lalique vases you'll be terrified of breaking. No excessive open areas of opulence you'll never frequent. Actually, are any of these negatives? What does satisfy you, though, is that it's a sensibly sized, stylishly furnished two-bedroom Manhattan top-floor penthouse-style apartment with just the right amount of swank, which is fully detached from any other suite or room on board. Yep, that's right, they are up on sky deck on their own, on opposite sides of the ship. <laughs> no, that's privacy. There's two bedrooms, both being cosy in proportion, but nonetheless furnished with those exceptionally comfy princess luxury beds and jacquard woven cotton linens. The second bedroom here has a beautiful sea view out of its own patio doors and a generous dressing area with a ton of storage and hanging space even Elton John would struggle to fill. But the bathroom is no bigger than a standard bathroom seen in a typical balcony cabin on board. Hmm, perhaps he could bring his tiny dancer as his guest. The other side of the living area is a beautiful double aspect master bedroom, which has the bed facing the sea, which is always a bonus in our opinion. and a similarly large dressing area, and a beautifully spacious bathroom, with bath and shower enclosure big enough for Benny and the Jets. Elton would definitely insist on having this one. Book a Sky Suite and your Ocean Medallion will be an exclusive shade of white, so that when you flash it at any crew around the ship, they'll be on alert for those special requests only accessible with a wink and a nod and they'll probably be off googling your name to check if you're famous. Also, it will indicate to other guests in the know that your place is a little sweeter than theirs. Each Sky Suite comes with a dedicated suite experience manager to cater for your every whim. And I guess they are trained to cope with even the most terrifying and demanding whims that some guests will bring on board. Helen and I have whims no bigger than pillow chocolates, so he or she would pretty much be on leave if we spent a week here. The Princess website boasts, complementing the exquisitely appointed interior living spaces, a luxuriously furnished over 1,000 square foot continuous balcony, the largest in our fleet, invites you to relax privately or host your own celebrations or catered events. The balcony, generously apportioned with a variety of luxury furniture, stretches almost all the way around, giving you 270 degrees of sunshine and privacy. I suspect you can sunbathe in as little clothes as you fancy on the rear enclosed terrace. There's even an outdoor TV here, but unfortunately no hot tub, which would be perfect in this very private area. And even with complimentary access to the enclave available, it would be nice to leap outside at any time in any weather in your skimpies with a glass of bubbles and a fit of giggles. At the other end of this colossal meandering terrace, you could watch the movies under the stars from your very own private viewing platform overlooking the pool deck. Unfortunately, there's no special remote control where you can change the channel on the giant screen, but you do get to choose your own movie from the list available. Neither is there a volume control in case you prefer an early night. I assume the soundproofing in the Sky Suite is pretty effective. Where the rear area is very private, the front area is quite public, so be prepared for other guests looking up at you curiously to check whether you're a celebrity they can pap, or disappointingly just some plain old anonymous lottery winner. Or YouTuber. Remember the princess website said the balcony? Invite you to relax privately, or host your own celebrations or catered events. This is exactly what we feel the Sky Suite balcony excels at, sharing with friends and family. When on board in 2019 for her inaugural voyage, we were invited to a wine tasting in the Sky Suite by some lovely private guests, and as you can see here on this footage I shot, the balcony is designed perfectly for parties, get-togethers, or even just pre-dinner cocktails with friends, 
and there'll be ample staff on hand to make it as grand as you like, and to make sure you don't have to lift a finger to tidy up afterwards. There we have it, a fully detached Manhattan-style loft apartment with the largest terrace in the Princess fleet. What more could you want? A baby grand piano? Hmm, maybe Elton would insist on one, but for us, no thanks. But a hot tub would be quite lovely, thank you. That's it for now. Please watch these other videos in our Sky Princess series right now, and please consider subscribing. Now, Movies Under the Stars begins in a minute, and it's Rocket Man. Wanna pop over? The champagne's on ice. <laughs>